In this video, Timmy's going to show you multiple different ways to switch user accounts on a Chromebook. In a previous video, Timmy shows you how to create multiple user accounts on a Chromebook, but if you want to be able to quickly switch between the user accounts, this is how that's done. The most normal way to switch between user accounts on a Chromebook is to sign out and then sign back in again. So if you were signed in here, you would come down and click on the time and come up and click sign out, like you've probably done many times before, to sign out and go back to the login screen. And then once you're back on the login screen, just click on the other account you want to be signed into and then type in your PIN or password to sign into that account. And now we've switched accounts. So now we're in that other account. And this method is probably the best option if it's two different people using this Chromebook. So one account for each different person because you have to fully sign out and then sign back in with your password to get into the other account. So it's kind of a bit more secure and you're just using one account at a time. But if you have multiple user accounts that you use, maybe a work one and a personal one or something like that, there is actually a way that you can be signed into both of them at the same time. That way you can really quickly switch between accounts all day long without having to type in different passwords and click on sign out and go back to the login screen and everything. So to do that, you just need to sign into one of the accounts you want to be signed into. So we've already done that. And now you just need to come down here again and click on the time in the bottom right hand corner. And now, in this menu, instead of clicking sign out to sign out, you actually click on the user account profile picture here. So we click on this picture here and now it has an option to sign in to another account. So if we click this, it will actually kind of take us back to the login screen. But as you'll see, the other account that we're already signed into is not here on the sign in screen because we're still signed into it. So now if you had multiple accounts on the, in this list as well, so if you had more than two accounts, you would need to choose which account you want to also sign into. But in this case, we only have one other account. So it's just the one account here. So we'll just type in the pin or password to sign into this account as well. And now we're in the other account. So we could now go ahead and open up an app or something and do whatever we want. It'll all be just like it would be in this account. So we've got this app open. You could open more or do whatever you wanted. But now if we click on the time in the bottom right hand corner again, if we now click on this profile picture, we'll have these two accounts listed here. So if you want to jump back to the other account, you would just click on it here and it jumps straight back to it. So you didn't have to go back to the sign in screen or put in a password or anything like that. We're right here. So now we might actually open an app here. So we'll just go with the files app to keep it simple. So, now we have the Files app open in this account and Google Chrome open in the other account. And if we quickly click down here and click on the profile picture and click on the other account, it'll jump back to the other account and all the apps will still be open because we're signed in to both of them at the same time. So this makes it really easy. You can have all your different apps open that you're using and just quickly jump between different accounts with different apps. So that's really convenient already, but if you can remember this keyboard shortcut, it actually gets even faster. So you have to be signed into multiple accounts first. So you have to do what Timmy just did, where we signed into multiple accounts. But 
Once you are, there's a cool keyboard shortcut that can really quickly jump between them. So, on your keyboard, if you hold down the Control key and the Alt key at the same time, you now just need to press either of these two arrow keys. So, not these normal arrow keys, it has to be these ones with the comma and the full stop on them. But, now if you just press one of these keys, it will immediately jump you to the other account. So, you just press that, that, and that, and you're in the other account. So, this can be really handy now, because you can be signed into your different accounts, and have all your apps open, and just press three keys, and you'll be in a different account. And it doesn't actually have to just be two accounts if you want. You can actually sign into three or four or five at once if you want to. You just come down and click on the time, and click on your profile picture, and then Timmy has already signed into all of the accounts on this Chromebook, but if you had more than two accounts, that button to add more accounts would still be here. So, you would just click that button, and then you'd be back to the sign-in screen, where you could sign into your third account, and switch between all three of them. But, that's really all there is to that. That's how you can easily switch between all your accounts on a Chromebook. And, once you're done with this, and you want to sign out of all your accounts, it's just a matter of clicking on this sign in, sign out button here. It now says sign out all, because it will sign out all of them. But, you just click that button here, and now you'll be signed out. And you'll be taken back to the login screen, where you can just sign in to one of these accounts. But, that's all there is to it. That's all the different ways you can switch between accounts on a Chromebook. So, hopefully you found this video helpful, and Tim will see you in the next one.